Hello everyone, Mauro here. In this lesson, we're going to look at steps to set a default GPU for an app on Windows 11. If you have a computer with more than one graphics card and you want a particular app to use a specific card, you can control this from the settings app. However, the experience will be a little bit different depending on the version of Windows 11 installed on your computer. Okay, let's dive into the steps. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. Now, to set a default GPU for an app on Windows 11 version 24H2 or a higher release, do this. Open Start and look for Settings. Then go to System and open the Display page. Then scroll down and go to the Graphics page. In here, you need to select the application and then from the GPU preference, you can select the GPU that you want the computer to use for that specific application. These settings might be different depending on your hardware configuration, but usually if you have two graphics card, you can choose the high performance that will be the more powerful GPU that you have in your system or the power saving mode. That's usually the integrated graphics card available on laptops and most motherboards. Now, if you're actually setting a default GPU for a game, make sure that this option is also turned on. Also, it is important to understand that, that making changes to the GPU in an application may cause unexpected results for that application. At any time, if you want to reset the application to the default settings, you can click the reset button. Now, if the app is not on the list, you can click the add desktop app button. And from here, you can search for the application and then select the executable for that application in order to add it to the list. And from there, you will have the option to change the preference. Now, if the app you're trying to customize or the game is an app that you have downloaded from the Microsoft Store, you will have to click the Add Microsoft Store App button. And here you're going to see a list of all the supported applications and then simply select the app and then from the list and select the GPU that you want that application to use. If you want to remove it, you need to reset the settings and then just click the Remove button. Now, if you have a computer still running Windows 11 version 23H2 or an older version, these are the steps that you need to follow to set the default GPU for apps on your computer. First, open Start and look for Settings. Then go to System and then open the Display page. Then open the Graphics page. Now, if the app is available on the list, simply select it, click the Options button, and from here, select the graphics card that you want to set as a default for that specific app. Same as version 24H2, you have two options, but that will depend on the graphics cards that you have on your computer. And from here, select power saving that will use the less powerful GPU available on your computer. But if you want the application to use the high performance GPU available on the computer, just select this option. And as you can see, you also get a warning right here. Now, if this is not a game, you can also check this option. Don't use optimization for windowed games. And then just click the save button. Now, if the application is not on the list, you need to select the type of app that you want to add. You can use desktop apps for traditional apps. And if you acquire the application from the Microsoft Store, you can select the option right here. And then you need to click the Browse button to select the app. And I'm just going to select a random application. And then from here, just click the Options button and select the graphics card that you want to assign for that application. Let me just show you really quick that if we choose the Desktop App option, when we click the Browse button, that will take us to this PC on your computer. And then you just need to find where that application is installed. And then you just need to select the executable that launches the application. And then click the Options button and select the graphics card that you want to set as the new default. Now, if you want to undo the changes, in my case, I like just to go back into the settings page for that application, choose the default option, which is let Windows decide. Click Save and then click the Remove button. It is important to note that when using the graphics preference on Windows 11, the settings will take presence 
over the same settings available on other control panels, such as those available from NVIDIA and AMD, which you can continue to use to configure additional features. Although Windows 11 makes it easy to set the default GPU an app can use, the system can always choose which graphics card to assign for that application. So if you change the graphics settings and the application defaults to another GPU, you will need to adjust the settings within the actual application if that is available. And that's pretty much it. That's how you set the default graphics card for an app on Windows 11 version 24H2 or an older release. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.